This is Nancy Note Dog, and welcome back to Backyard Bonsai. It has been about a year since we started this Japanese maple fusion project. And in the past year, I have grown about four inches. I have gotten way smarter and have much nicer shoes. Since this winter, all the leaves have fallen off so we can finally take a closer look at the trunk. As you can see, there's been significant trunk fusion. Now, let's dig it up, trim the roots, and take a closer inspection. As you can see, the fusion has worked quite well around the apex, and moderately well around the midsection, but still needs a fuse more on the base, but that should happen in the next couple of years. As you can see, planting it over a tile really helped develop the nabari, and the surface roots are thickening quite nicely. I forgot to mention last year that the seeds were from a coral bark maple tree. As everyone knows, maple seeds don't necessarily resemble the parent. So, there is coral bark and green bark, giving it a striped appearance. I'm excited to see how this turns out. And now, let's plant it back in the garden, again placing it over a tile. Well, there you have it. This is Nancy Note Doll signing off. Please check in next year to see how much smarter I am. I mean, to see how this project is going. Please also check my other videos coming as soon as my video editor gets his act together. Well, goodbye.